Thank you so much. You too. They didn't even have to ask for a straw. Oh my God, there were bees outside. Why is there a river right here? First of all, love that guy. I think they're starting to know me. That's embarrassing. I don't care. I was supposed to be at Franny's like mm, 15 minutes ago. What's happening here. Okay, so basically I left the house like later than I wanted to. I don't like, I don't like what my hair is doing. We're gonna change that. We're going to an event in Malibu and it's super far out. We have to leave like super early to get there. I left the house and Caleb had like left for the gym and he was like, uh, just to let you know, all the lights are out around us. So like we've had really bad rain and then yesterday the wind, like the past two days, the wind was actually insane. People's like fences are knocked over, freaking trees are falling, like it's a wreck here. And all of the lights within like blocks and blocks of us are out. Excuse me, can't get anywhere fast because all the lights are out, so everyone's just treating them like uh, stop signs. You know, that never goes well because no one even knows how stop signs work nowadays. But I got ready. I'll show you my outfit when I get to Franny's. I don't like love it. I did my makeup. My makeup is giving. My hair, not. I think I'm gonna braid these instead of having them crimped. Realized, if you can't tell by the shakiness of my phone, that I forgot my camera. I wanted to vlog this whole thing because I think it'll be funny because we have no idea what to expect from this event I forgot my camera I need to take the fattest poop live it happened like right as I left the house so I'm gonna have to do it at Franny's and like sometimes I'm poop shy like I don't like pooping in friends houses but like I have to go so I, I said Franny I'm coming in we're not off to a good start all right guys I'm at Franz now we're going to the event together I'm wearing this little knit it's like see-through and I was gonna wear it for the summer but here we are you can literally see through it okay with a big leather jacket my black cowboy boots I found these both at like Chelsea's pop-up shop the boots and the dress so <laughs> they were like 10 bucks and then my hair is like back like this and a little clippy and I made these braids instead like I said I was going to in the car and then Francesca is here okay, I'm sorry for the mess <laughs> we're just getting ready oh you're in your bra oh yeah i mean i'm just filming like this is fine <laughs> we're also wearing the same bra the same skims bra and we're basically when i put my outfit on you guys are gonna see i'm we're wearing basically the same thing, i know i walked so in funny. i walked in or i got out of the car in front of goes oh because look this is her outfit that she that she laid on the bed we wear silver cowboy boots a knit dress that's the same color as mine but she's wearing like a little white crop situation doesn't matter all right guys we this is this is what we're wearing we're matching but we're opposite yeah, I just got the dark vibes. I have the light vibes. She's got the light vibes. A silver cow. She's going cow. summer. I'm going winter. Breeze my ass off. I know both of our dresses are like knit, just like, like easy breezy, beautiful, beautiful cover, cover girl. <laughs> is what it is. <laughs> film anything yesterday at the event that we went to. I was having too much of a good time and I didn't expect it to be that good of a time. Now I'm gonna run some errands. Um, it's the next day. I, my hair is crusty dusty. I'm giving, I'm giving little boy today. Car shirt, oversized dad shorts, my fave, one of my fave finds from the market. Knock off Uggs and socks. I don't care. And then no makeup, we're going naked. I need to go to Ulta. Ulta and what do I need to do? Ulta. Starbucks. Maybe Trader Joe's for like small things. I have like two meals that I still need to cook. I don't know. I'm scared to go outside because yesterday, as I told you guys, the lights were out. Like all of the stoplights were having issues yesterday for like blocks and blocks and blocks and blocks. There were like issues with the stoplights being out and it creates, what? That's not a word. It created havoc in this town. I'm trying to be productive. I need to clean my room, but I just cleaned the whole living room and kitchen and I swiffered it and stuff. I was just going in and I didn't know that I was gonna do it. Surprise myself. The roads here, when it rains, like the roads just blow up and it, the giant holes start coming out of nowhere. It's like the rain erodes the ground. But there I are. So there's a lot of holes in the roads. It is Friday and everyone is out and about and it is 65 today. It's so pretty. Oh, I hate coming to the center. Oh, there it was almost a car wreck because nobody knows how to drive. Anyways, I'm pulling into the parking lot and it looks like there's no parking. Why do I do this to myself? I'm in like a Pinoho West Center. I love this place. It's literally so cute. And I got my Starbucks. Mm -hmm. And I was bad today and I got sweet cream cold foam on top, so. 
I'm walking over to Ulta now because I need to get several things that I'm running out of and I just haven't gone and got. Also, when I was in Starbucks, this guy ordered and he like turned around. Mind you, there's plenty of room. He like turned around and he elbowed the shit out of me and it made me so mad. Thank you so much, sir. Okay, here we're forward crossing. I almost rolled my ankle, but he like shouldered the shit out of me. I am the dirtiest hook. And then like 10 minutes later, it felt like he was like, sorry. Oh, you didn't see me? You guys, I had to stop because I think a bug just fell into my eyeball. I don't know what that was. That scared me. Like, oh, it's so warm. I've been like sweating all day. And then as soon as I go out into the outside world, it's freezing. Like my leg hair grew at least three inches. Um, I only ended up going to Starbucks and Ulta. After that, I'm ready to go home. One day I'll go to Trader Joe's. Every time I'm like, oh, I'm gonna go to Trader Joe's, one day I'll get there. But I'm gonna show you what I got at Ulta. I'm proud of myself and I got some things that are the cheaper versions of other things that I would usually get, but we're on a budget. The first thing is I almost got new mod perfume by Ariana Grande because I already wear her cloud perfume and it's my favorite scent. And this like, the white one is like a vanilla and the pink one is like a blush, like more florally scent. I don't love like floral scents, but this was the last little like sample tester. I almost bought the white one, but I couldn't. It had to be like a full version of it. It wasn't like a sample version. It wasn't like a travel size version. I'm just gonna go home, we're gonna sit on it. And then I got, okay, I was really proud of myself for this because I needed a beauty blender and beauty blenders are like 22 dollars and I just think that is like a ridiculous amount of money for a sponge. I know that a lot of people say that Morphe sponges are exactly the same. So cheap. This was ten dollars. Can you see it? Can you see it? It's the Morphe by Ariel. Makeup by Ariel. First of all the color of the sponge is so cute. <gasps> It's so cute and it feels exactly like a beauty blender. So I'm just gonna try it. It was 10 bucks. Say less, brother. I get more of my mascara. Okay, so I do waterproof mascara and then I do not waterproof because my lashes don't like like regular mascara. They don't stay up. And I use the Sky High by Maybelline. I've used this mascara for as long as I can remember. It's my go-to. I love everything about it. I use the Ordinary uh, Niacinamide Serum. Also one of my go-tos, had to get more of that. Got a brush for blending like my bronze or my cream products out because I only have one and I use it for all of them and that's probably not the best for my skin. It's expensive thing. It's this face lotion that I use um, in the mornings. It's just like a restorative protective fragrance for I really like this brand. You see it? There it is. I ran out so I just needed some more. It's like the smallest but it lasts a really long time and I love this lotion. It makes my face feel juicy again. So that's all I got. That was this is really expensive and something else is like really good prices. This is like 12, I think. This was like six. I don't know how much this is, probably like 10. 10, okay. My little haul. I needed to get out of there because I was about to buy everything. I also got the fattiest paper cut. So now we're gonna go home. Cause that's enough peopling for me, thanks. It's been, oh. it's been a couple days since I vlogged. I actually don't know the last time that I had the camera with me. We are gonna go to, I think Ulta again. <laughs> Because I tried that perfume, that Ariana Grande perfume, and I really liked it. And so, ow, my stomach hurts. Oh, ow, 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 ow. I got a cold brew today. Dude, ow. Okay, anyways, I feel sick. <laughs> gonna go back to Ulta and probably get that. I really liked it and so did Anthony, which is what I wanted. I wanted him to smell it cause like I want my boyfriend to like the way that I smell, you know? And then I need to go to Trader Joe's. The last video where I was like, oh, I need to go to Trader Joe's. I still haven't gone and we still need to get my coffee cause the everywhere has still been out of it. So this will be a mission and a half. I might even have to go to Target. I'm gonna go to Target. Here we go. It's very chilly outside too. I just did like a shoe in my room and in this cute little set. You'll see TikToks in it. Had to get ready, semi. Here we go, another adventure. Um, once again, this could be tragic. I decided to come on a Monday. The parking garage is full. Do you guys ever like when you're going in the parking garage and it's like, like all the spots say compact. So you're like, okay, where am I supposed to park? So I take my Grand Cherokee and I, I'm like, I'm compact. I can make it compact because I need a parking spot. Anyways, there looks like there's a lot of people in here. <laughs> I hate doing this. You guys, when I tell you I think I'm going to pass out right now, oh my gosh. Okay, first of all, it wasn't that bad in the grocery store and Trader Joe's was stocked up. They only had like a handful of things, literally like three things that I needed. So annoying, but I have to go somewhere else to get them. After Trader Joe's, the guy was like, one of the bags is really heavy. And usually I only have like two bags of groceries from there and he filled a third one. So I was like, 
because my car was parked kind of far. And so I was like, it's fine. I'm going to, I'm going to do it. I'm just going to chuck them all on my arm and I'm going to make it to the car. When I tell you my left arm about dislocated and f fell off of me because it was so heavy, I was exerting so much energy. I thought I was going to pass out. And then when I put the bags in my car, I got so lightheaded. I had to like take a minute because I was like, and I was like winded because it hurt my left arm so bad. And now it's like twitchy. That's what I get. Anyways, then I went to Ulta to go get the perfume, right? Because the other day they had like several boxes of it. And I went in and I didn't see it anywhere. So I asked the girl and she was like, we might be out of that one. But let me go check in the back. She goes and checks in the back. And she's like, so sorry. It literally looks like someone came in today and bought all three of the last boxes we had. Who buys three boxes of full-size perfume? Is she just stocking up or are they like gifts? Anyways, they have the travel size, so I just went with that because I was like, now this is just too much work. They have the travel size of the Mod Vanilla, and I'm pumped about it because it smells so good, and then I'll pull the trigger on the full size here in a little. Um, I also put her God is a Woman hand lotion on. She, I'm gonna buy all of that woman's products. I literally am going to. Okay, now I need to go get the other stuff and I need to go home. I can't feel my left shoulder. Sun is directly in my face right now. What is this man doing? Girl, what are you doing? This man with like the biggest truck in the world just parked next to me. Okay, anyways. Um, went to Target. Got all the goods. They had so much of my coffee that I wanted to buy like six six bottles but that won't fit in our fridge so i got two and then so i was stoked on that because everywhere else i look it's out and then what else oh i got some pickles they had some of the what is it grillo's hot pickles that sounded good as fuck i love pickles so i'm gonna eat some of those when i get home and then what else did i get oh my gosh i got vincent some like new bowls i'll show you guys so cute and a little scooper for his food because i use a measuring cup for it they didn't have green onions like no one has green onions so i'm confused so fuck the green onions i ain't going to a third place to find them so we're on our way home okay guys i'm back home from the grocery store and i'm gonna do a little trader joe's haul i got a lot of stuff there and i it was pretty cheap i love that place but i got a sesame crunch chopped salad kit i've never tried this um i got my favorite bread from there the gluten-free whole grain bread and everyone on tiktok makes fun of this because the bread is really teeny tiny but that's what happens when you have gluten-free bread um okay my favorite things in the entire world, gluten-free cinnamon coffee cake muffins. I could eat four of these a day. They're ridiculously good. Got a bunch of stuff for Anthony because sometimes obviously he doesn't want to eat the things that I eat because he's not gluten dairy free. So I got him a mushroom and black truffle flatbread. This sounds so good. He loves truffle. I don't understand, but he does. The impossible chicken nuggets because they're to die for and I always get those. I got myself any chicken tacos. I don't know if you guys have ever had these, but they're so good. Gluten free and dairy free because they don't have cheese in them. Um, I got two pounds of ground chicken because I'm going to do like ground chicken, Asian sesame meatballs. Um, it was a recipe Sandy, Sandy, Granny is what I meant. Sent me Sydney Carlson. I made it like a week ago and it was so good. So I'm going to do those again. Just got the ground chicken for those. Cucumbers, because I eat them a lot with a lot of things. Red pepper, or pepper trio, because I eat peppers with everything, but I got them because I make these salmon bowls and I add all three of those peppers, onions, salmon, and it's like, mm, it's so good. Oh, these are for Anthony too. They now, instead of just the frozen chocolate croissants, Trader Joe's has, has this regular chocolate croissant so you can buy in the bread section. Favorite sausage from there, I see jalapeno chicken sausage. We eat it with so many things. My favorite dressing that I'm gonna put on the um, chickpea wraps. It's creamy dill dressing. It's so good in a chicken salad too. This is for Anthony too, because he really likes these crackers and they have a garlic version of them. Garlic non-crackers. Okay, I've seen these all over TikTok. I've had the regular ones. They're the sour version. I'm on a sour, sour candy kick. Um, I got the chicken tiki masala, not for myself. I'll probably try a bite of it, but Anthony loves this. And we've never tried the Trader Joe's one, but I've heard really good things about it. We've been snacking on these. They're to die for. The dark chocolate half coated rice cakes. Guys, they're so good. Me and Anthony are obsessed with them. So of course, I got some peach wine, it's like a Capri Sun. Black beans because I put black beans in my rice. Uh, oh, at Target, I got like chopped cilantro. You put them in your rice. It's so good. At Target, quickly, I got my my cold brew. They finally had it in stock, so I bought two. And then I, these are the pickles I was talking about. The Grillo's Hot Pickles. I'm gonna wrap, wrap them shits in turkey. We're gonna have another bag from Trader Joe's. Please hold. 
avocados because Anthony is an avocado. He eats so many of them. Best thing that Trader Joe's has, the vegan tzatziki dip. I could put a spoon in it and just eat it. I eat it with everything, tacos. Our salmon bowls, our like chicken, pita pockets we make, everything. Sliced Korean rice cakes. If you just follow the recipe on the back for like the fried rice cakes, stir fry, I did that once. So good. So strawberry jam for Anthony and his peanut butter and jellies because he's a giant 10 year old. And garlic powder because if you don't put garlic powder on everything, then you're doing life wrong. I got Vincent new bowls because right now he's janky and he has like two mismatched bowls that we just like found while we were moving or like that me and Franny had and she didn't use for Henry anymore. So I just wanted to get him matching bowls. That was my grocery haul. Finally went to Trader Joe's. And that's pretty much, I get a lot of the same things when I go every time. Got a lot of new stuff this time that sometimes I don't take my time and look and I was just, I was strolling through there today. My little grocery haul. I don't know if you have any questions about it or like what meals I make with what, or I can just show you what I do. No, we'll figure it out. But that's the groceries I got today. I'm making a snack right now. I do the hot pickles spheres wrap them in the smoked turkey breast from trader joe's because it's literally so good i don't know why i've eaten this my whole life so i'm gonna make a snack and then i'm gonna sit and i'm gonna watch sex life also look at vincent and his little bowls his new bowls he loves them um but yeah i'm just gonna chill and i'm gonna watch um sex life i started the new season and um i'm just gonna chill for a second i'm waiting for anthony to get home and then i'll make dinner later and i'll show you what i end up making you see my eyes not me absolutely sobbing like a baby at the end of sex life i cry about I, like i'm such a crier when it comes to shows and so i can cry like sad music it starts and i cry just sobbing at the end of it get it together i want to show you the new cups that i got at flea market i finally found these new glasses if you can see they're like green but like clear but green tinted i'm obsessed with them and they were 24 bucks for both of them. I'm obsessed with them and I'm gonna put my coffee in it right now. And yes, I'm having a coffee at 7 p.m. I'm getting sleepy and I can't get sleepy. I'm so excited about them. They're so, they're like me in a glass. I want my kitchen when I have like a house house that I like own to be like greens, even like the cabinets and stuff. Still waiting for Auntie to get home. I don't fall asleep on the couch before he gets here. <laughs> oh, best creamer in the game, silk almond milk. Vanilla, it goes so good with this iced coffee from Stoke. Last straw is the best, there's like 80 of them. I got like a pack of literally like 20. They're straight and curved, Amazon. My Amazon, you can find them on my Amazon storefront. These are the best. And I think glass straws make everything taste better. Like iced things taste better through a glass straw. It's not little, it's actually a pretty fat cup. It's so good to have my coffee back, you guys. I feel like a new person. Everything tastes better now. A new mug, glass straw. My iced coffee's back. The bitch is back. The bitch is motherfucking back. I'm making dinner. I forgot to show the process, but that's fine because it would have taken too long. But these are chicken, ground chicken meatballs with like chopped green onions, garlic, soy sauce, sesame oil, and gluten-free panko breadcrumbs. So I made a whole bunch of them because I got two pounds of chicken. And then I'm making the sauce, which is like a garlic, um, soy vinegar sauce. It literally smells so good. And yes, I put a butt ton of garlic in it because we like garlic. And then I have rice cooking over here in the rice cooker. Um, but yeah, you just put it like on a bed of rice you put that like soak the meatballs in the sauce and that shit is so good like i said earlier i got it from sydney carlson's instagram because franny sent it to me it's so easy and it's so good and you can like make the meatballs as big as you want and it's so filling add a little avocado so that's what me and Anthony are gonna eat it is almost 10 and he is just about to get home I have not seen him all day and ready to eat and yes it's a late dinner but i also ate late i ate at like five i had like the pickles and then i got up and i had cheese and crackers and salami i just kept snacking so it's fine too easy to turn the light on but this is what it looks like plated Anthony is finally home wow we're talking about it all day and he's finally are you actually here. recording me right now you know what happens when you get these meatballs around me why why does he get so close you know what happens when the meatballs get around me <laughs> these are anthony's these are anthony's favorite meatballs and he didn't know i was making them so meatballs good night you make me feel like